Okay guys, I'm at the Susan Philpot residence. She's using a 20 by 20 by 1 filter. Uh, this is in a crawl space. Um, you've got about 2 foot 38 inches um, from this bottom of the dirt area to the top of the joist right there. And um, your furnace is about 58 inches long. So here is your return end uh, down here to where your filter's at. And your supply little supply box about 12 inches wide and then it goes into a, a big super big round return into the floor up there if you can see that it's kind of hard to get full pick of everything here but we're going to follow it along and do the best we can and then here's your supply end over here and we've got some return or i mean some supply coming out of here um, you've actually got about um, about six runs off of this in supply plenum. Um, measure this area right here, link with heist, and your coil area right in here. Um, so this is what we're looking like here. Your three quarter inch line goes up like so, and so we are we are actually venting over here on this side. I don't know if you can see that or not, but um, I, I cannot get around there on that end. See where it... Anyway, as you can see, confined space. This is where we're at. It's under underneath the crawl space, and uh, there's your electrical on the front. Um, basically this furnace is pretty old it has some challenges going on and the heat exchanger is uh, kind of worn so we're contemplating on whether or not to replace it and um, that is about all um, so we've talked about the gas line uh, there is no um, your your drain line is I don't even see it. I don't know where that is going out at. And I do not see the flu either. So, gotta figure out where that goes. I'll come back to you here in just a minute. 